Hello class! Welcome to today's math lesson. Our learning goal today is to be able to identify and count with ordinal numbers all the way to 12th. Hmm. Ordinal numbers help us indicate position, like maybe where someone would be in a line. So today, could you get out maybe some of your little toys or your stuffies and put them in line and count them from 1st through 12th? Hmm. Or you could do that with your cars. You could put them in a traffic jam and count them from 1st through 12th. Well, let's take a minute to count right now from 1st through 12th. 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th, 11th, and 12th. Well, let's take a closer look. I have a fun AB pattern here, and I would like for us to count it from 1st to 12th. 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th, 11th, 12th. When I count them, I add the sound th to many of my numbers. Not all of them. First has an ST. Second, third, also don't have TH, but fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth, eleventh, and twelfth all have TH at this end. Class, I would like for you to get out some crayons because we are going to practice putting some things in order today. So when you get your crayons out, I'm going to have you find the red one and put the red one first. So we are going to have the red one first and then for second, I would like for you to put the green crayon. So red is first, green is second, and then the yellow one is going to be third. First, second, third. Our fourth crayon is going to be the pretty brown one. And the fifth one, I would like for you to put the orange one. When we use ordinal numbers like first, second, third, fourth, fifth, they're telling us which order we should be putting things in. After the orange one, we are going to make the black crayon our sixth. And then for number seven, it's going to be our blue one. Blue will be seventh and purple will be eighth. First, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, and eighth. So, I would like for you to take a close look at all of your colors and I am going to ask you, hmm, which color crayon is the fourth? First, second, third, fourth. The fourth one is our brown one. Now, which crayon is our seventh? Which color? It is the blue one. Very well done. And what about our second? Which color is the second? Yes, 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 it's the green. And what about the eighth crayon? First, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth is our purple one. Now I'm going to ask you to change the order and I want you to take your purple one and put it as the second crayon. Hmm. Now, which crayon is the seventh? <laughs> You're right, it is our black crayon. Now I'm going to have you put the blue one away and I want you to find which crayon is in the middle. Hmm, I'll take one off each end, and one off each end, and one off each end, and which one was in the middle? It is, it's the yellow one. It was the first, second, third, fourth crayon. Well done, class. You should take some time today 
practicing putting things in order and using some ordinal or order numbers. We could see which item is first in line. And I have a berry which is first. And then second is a leaf. Third is a berry. Fourth is a leaf. Fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth, eleventh, and twelfth. The leaf is our twelfth item or our last item in our pattern. Oh class, thank you so very much for learning with me today. I hope that you had a wonderful time counting ordinal numbers from first through twelfth. Take some time to practice today. Have a great day. Bye-bye.